Hey guys, so I just want to talk to you about something that's on my heart. Um, you know, I receive a lot of criticism and this isn't, to, you know, to, to tell you all the things that, you know, I are told to me, you know, about the old wonder and some of the things that I'm saying, you know, false prophet, all that kind of stuff. Those are the easy stuff. But, um, yeah, so I want to tell you the plan for how the whole wonder handles criticism and things like that, like at least what goes on in my heart. Because if you are going to continue to follow me and, uh, you know, bless and support and encourage, you know, the ministry of Behold Wonder, I want you to know what goes on deep in my heart and how I plan to move forward, you know, in the midst of um, criticism, in the midst of people who just don't understand. Number one is I have to remember that God loves those who uh, who disagree with me he loves them and he loves them with an intensity that um, i can't describe so i cannot live in anger i cannot live in frustration and i have to remember you know that people are going to be people and um, no one is perfect but everyone is loved god loves those who disagree with you, who disagree with Behold Wonder's message, you know, and that's okay. We can disagree and still, you know, follow the Lord and still love Jesus. What will pollute Behold Wonder is if I continue uh, to move forward in a critical spirit because, you know, I can be, I can succumb to criticism. I can prophesy out of a critical heart out of a frustrated heart and then when i'm supposed to be speaking life into human hearts i'm speaking death and destruction and we do not want that and behold wonder its message is to bring forth life it is to empower you to love jesus it is to empower you to look towards jesus and fall in love with him to encounter his presence and never be the same I just, it, it never be the same to start a new and beautiful journey with him. You know, I had this dream uh, some years ago where I was standing across a, 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 a bridge and people were on one side and I was on the other and I was uh, waving people down and I was really passionate saying, come on, come on this side of the bridge, come on, come on, you know, and trying to tell them that there's so much life and blessing on the other side. And I was saying, come on, come on. And people weren't moving and they were looking at me and kind of like, I'm crazy. Some of them were just as scared. Some of them were just not interested. And I started to get really sad. I went from emotions of feeling really sad to being really, really frustrated and then confused and wondering what was going on. And, um, and then the Holy Spirit spoke to me in the dream. He said, no, Micah, you must cross the bridge, go to where they are and bring them with you. You must walk with them across the bridge. And so I went to the other side of the bridge and I held their hands and we began to walk across the bridge together. And um, that's what Behold Wonder does. You know, we walk through the process. We're walking through the process. I understand that some of the things that I'm sharing with you and if it's your first time listening to me or following me or whatever, that some things are gonna sound strange. Some things are gonna be box breaking, you know? And I have to have a heart full of grace and understanding that, yeah, this is different. Yeah, this is groundbreaking. This is, can be sometimes hard to swallow. It is sometimes too fantastic, fantastic to believe. You know, but I'm not here to make anyone believe anything. I just want you to know what is available, what you can have, you know, and I'm going a direction and I'm just shouting at the top of my lungs, come on, come with me, you know, but there are going to be people who are going to disagree with me and that's okay. There are going to be people who are going to disagree with how I live, you know, what I believe or what I say, but I have to remember that they are all loved. God loves them and his love is fabulous you know and i have to look at them as a loved being not as someone who um is critical you know criticizes me so i just wanted to share that uh with you um that's how behold wonder handles those who don't agree with me you know and that's okay so anyway thanks for listening and i'll talk to you guys soon